the election result and a massive Tory majority. So now Boris Johnson can get on with his Brexit deal, which he assures us is oven ready, though he may have to wait before using that oven, as there are a lot of Labour candidates queuing up to put their heads in it. <laughs> It's the biggest Tory majority since the days of Margaret Thatcher, who, of course, developed the philosophy of Thatcherism, whereas the only ism Boris has produced begins with a J. <laughs> the Greens lost out in County Durham, where they'd really been banking on getting a vote from David Bellamy. Oh, dead people. Oh, gosh. Gosh. <laughs> yes. The um, Greens managed to get one seat. Biggest climate crisis in history, one seat. Mm. Got to be something wrong with the system, hasn't there? Mm. Absolutely. And I can trust this government to... Ch uh... <laughs> <laughs> Paul and Nicky, yes. take a look at this. Yes, uh, Boris Johnson on the phone in. Uh, Jeremy Corbyn, how many minutes left as leader? Uh, <laughs> this is her new job. She's doing quite well there. <laughs> He's about to go a little bit mad. There he is. <laughs> and, uh, that's... Christmas came early. Everything's broken. So, yeah. <laughs> It's the last week of election campaigning, which really it? gripped the nation. Yeah, absolutely. As, I was as gripped. Evidenced by this clip. Yeah. Are you excited? No, not a bit. <laughs> <laughs> that could have been me. Uh, where did Boris begin his final day of campaigning? He was delivering uh, milk in... I was going to say Leeds, but I, I could be wrong. Le Yorkshire. Let's just kill, yeah, well. say Yorkshire. Let's have a look. Hello, good morning. Morning. Mrs. Bollock. Are you Mrs. Bollock? Yes, yes. Hello, good morning. I didn't realise you were going to be this many people. I've come to... I've come to, look, I've come to deliver your milk, Mrs. Bollock. <laughs> <laughs> How many pints, Mrs? Is your husband in? <laughs> <laughs> How many pints of milk has that poor woman got, then? Yeah. I'm afraid of it. Yeah. They're obviously stockpiling there. They know something we don't. <laughs> <laughs> Boris Johnson got into difficulties on his round. He was ambushed by someone asking him for an interview. That's right. Which is, uh, you know, absolutely appalling thing to ask of a man who wants to be Prime Minister. So he rightly went away and hid in a fridge. Let's have a look. I just had a reaction here from one of the minders. Uh, wow. Okay, the don't push that too much. On his face. Wow. That minder. You're not getting near <laughs> Boris. Prime that. Minister, would you come on Good Morning Britain and deliver on your promise to talk to no. Piers and Susanna? We're ready to go. We're live on, on ITV right now. Prime Minister, you have an earpiece in my pocket. You're more than welcome to come on. Mr Johnson, while you have five minutes, you're live on Good Morning. Why did, why could, could you talk to you, Piers and Susanna for me? I'll be, I'll be with you in a second. I'll be with you in a second. Yeah, Thank I have an earpiece here in my hands, ready to go. <laughs> right, he's been taken inside, into the freezer. He's gone into the fridge. He's got, got milk to get on and deliver. He's got yeah, a couple he customers waiting. Then he shouldn't be in a fridge, then, should he? <laughs> They're days of accountability and asking people their opinion are over. You just hide from the questions you don't want to answer. You lie about the things that you want to do. And, and then you get a stonking mandate. Get a big... <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>